What else can I tell you? I'm married. I got a kid. Yeah. Oh, you don't have to clap. I just didn't wear a condom. I had real sex. You ever had real sex? No, I mean, have you ever just left it in? On purpose? Just blowing nuts right into the Death Star? the creepiest thing on this planet. <laughs> Making a baby, having a baby is the most brutal thing ever. My wife, oh man, my wife was in labor for 12 hours. I saw a vaginal birth. Yeah, I've been to Vietnam, motherfuckers. <laughs> There's nothing more hardcore than a vaginal birth. I don't care how many knife fights and tattoos you got. <laughs> Making a person when there's not a person? Just be like, oh, here's a person. <laughs> really likes Netflix. <laughs> I was in a room with my wife for 12 hours, screaming, crying, blood. It's brutal. I never hung out with her longer than two in my life. <laughs> Having a baby is like being in a car accident. <laughs> then somebody just hands you a baby afterwards. <laughs> Dude, it's so rough. My, after, after seven hours, like, my wife asked for the epidural. Do you know about the epidural? Yeah, yeah that's real drugs. <laughs> that's serious drugs. They bring out this, like, Citibank ATM-looking machine, and it had a glass tube filled with government morphine, <laughs> three feet high. And then they take a wire with a prongs at the end of it, and they t pull it out right in front of me. Mm. And they put it right in the back of her neck. <laughs> like some type of weird tool video. It's like, mm. <laughs> And in this hand, they give her a trigger, and anytime she's feeling pain, she hits the trigger, and she's dumping pure government morphine into her central nervous system. Now, my wife's done a lot of drugs, right? <laughs> so she's hitting this like Final Jeopardy. She's just like, click, 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 my uterus is killing me for a thousand, Alex. Click, click, click. Numb it. Numb the pain. Numb the pain. Now, the good thing is, she's no longer feeling any pain. The bad thing is, she's just straight tripping. Because we're all like, push, push. She's like, we all live in a yellow submarine. Lasers. Doctor pulls me aside. He's like, Rob, if your wife doesn't have this baby in the next hour, we're going to have to give her a C-section. We're going to have to cut her open right in front of you. I was like, doctor, do you have any idea how high I am right now. <laughs> then I just got right in my wife's face. I said, Ann, you see that wall? You shoot for the wall, Ann. <laughs> you shoot for the wall. Get it out, they're gonna shank you. This is prison rules. Then the baby comes out. I, I was just raising so much hell. It worked. You got to use emotion in life. I got it out, yelling, screaming. Baby came out. And that was scary, right? But then the scariest thing happened. It's out of my wife, the placenta. Oh. A blood ghost came flying out of my wife. <laughs> and I'm talking a red you've I never seen. Like the color was a maroon, like maroon 9000. It was the scariest thing I've ever seen. So scary. You want a you want a scary Halloween costume? <laughs> Go as the placenta. <laughs> I just want to make note right now that I'm the only comedian doing placenta material out there. <laughs> All right, thank you very much New York. Peace love. <laughs>